Hey guys, um, welcome back to, of course, another haul video. I have like a whole bunch of stickers that I wanted to go ahead and show you guys. There are so many here in this stack and I just wanted to go through them because I haven't really been ordering too many stickers now. I'm just currently waiting until November, of course. Today is October 3rd and it doesn't even feel like the year is about to end anytime soon. Um, as always, if you guys are interested to find any of these shops, they will all be in the description box below. And sorry if you can hear my fan blaring. It's just always hot in my room, like I say in almost every single haul. But I just want to go ahead and hop right into what I got. So the first shop I got stickers from was Glam Planner. And she did not have a lot of kits that I personally wanted just because I've decided I really like her mini kit format. So I only got a few kits. And I'm currently waiting for her next glitch sale because I am hopefully thinking that some of the holiday ones are going to go glitch. And also, I really wanted to buy a lot of the princess ones in the mini kit format. Unfortunately, those like sold out pretty fast apparently, so I unfortunately couldn't get my hands on those. But I did get my hands on one, which I love. This is the Moana kit. Now, I know there's like a huge controversy on whether or not Moana is a Disney princess and I can completely understand that. Anyways, I, in my opinion, I consider her a Disney princess, but that's just personally me. Also, there is a really cute camera. I just admire this box so much. And then there's like Pua, oh my gosh, how cute. If you guys don't know, also Alicia, my planner best friend, she literally hates Hey Hey, but he is quite something. Also, if you can see like that like line, it's. It's just my blind, so <laughs> yeah, this is, I think, the old format, and that's why it has, like, this mini sticker right here. I'm honestly not even quite sure, so we're just going to go ahead and go right on through it. So this is what it looks like. I also really like the rainbow. I just really like the colors as well. These are colors that I don't really ever use in my planner, so these are so cute. Also, in my opinion... The deco is really big, but then again, I don't really use deco of all the things. <laughs> that is really funny. And this is like a really, really, really busy washi, so I'm not sure if I will personally be using this, but I do like the date covers. Those are a really pretty shade of blue. But yeah, that was her, I guess this is her old format from what I understand. Okay, so that is the first kit. And then the second kit I'm gonna show you guys is actually this kit. I know in a previous haul I have talked about this kit. And this is, I think, the June Mystery. Yeah. And then you're probably wondering why do I have the glitter when it's not a luxe kit? So actually, my friend Laura, Laura, wow, I said Lauren. Laura sent me a bunch of leftovers, so I will be pulling these in, which Whenever I use this kit, I will be doing that, but it's just this really pretty blue. I don't know if you can tell underneath my lamp. And then there's like this really pretty like pink magenta color. It's really pretty. It's kind of hard to see underneath my lamp. Hang on, let me go ahead and just do this for just a second if you guys can tell. It's this really pretty pink. And as you can tell, there are leftovers. And then we have like this really pretty ocean blue with these ones so these are like half cut headers which are kind of in my opinion very convenient and then there's like a whole bunch of other things so the good thing is is that I feel like I don't need to buy glitter headers for this kit after getting all those leftovers but let's just go into the kit I really like the flamingo aspect and also look at the little docks it's a dachshund right I'm pretty sure that's how you pronounce it but my sister loves these dogs. They are so darn cute. The little Polaroid, oh my gosh, this is so cute. And as you all know, I love pink and yellow together. So I don't know why I never really bought this kit <laughs> until now. I don't know, maybe it just didn't hit me until now that I was like, oh my gosh, I need to buy this. Also, I love the little airplane ones. Brennan loves, <laughs> as you all know, Brennan, my boyfriend, he loves airplane things since he is an aspiring pilot. There are deco, which most of are yellow, which I kind of like. And then this is the bottom washi. I really like this one. I'm not even going to lie with you. It's not that busy. It's pretty simple. This just looks a little, 
I don't know if you want to say like pixelated, but like <laughs> it's definitely not clear. Like it's not a clear picture. And it looks like something you could just make yourself. No offense, but that is just my opinion. And that is the June mystery kit that I got. So the last kit I'm actually really excited about because I had no idea what this kit was called and I've seen so many people haul it and I'm like, what is this kit? I need to find it. But I finally got it in a glitch show. So happy I got it. So this is what the kit looks like. It reminds me a lot of that Aspen Ovard kind of kit, but this looks like it's like a mature version of it. I know that sounds really weird as a comparison, but honestly, when you think about it, it does. Now I know I think the Lux comes with like different boxes that you could choose um, whether it's like a birthday graduation wedding I think I'm not 100% sure but I know it comes with like different boxes and I really like that but personally I do see like baby shower graduation wedding I don't know I see so many occasions that I could totally be using this kit but I'm not even sure what I want to use it for because it's a mini kit and I just I don't know. Oh my gosh, look at the little macarons. Oh my gosh. I didn't even realize that until now. But those are, oh wow, that is so cute. Oh my gosh, I can't. But yeah, this does remind me a lot of Aspen Ovard as well. And I just really like the neutral color scheme. This is like really, to me, this is like very minimal. And as you can tell, like the deco kind of explains it all. But I am not going to be using this, honestly. I don't think I will be. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. This is like date covers I really like. I really like these. And then we have like the little rainbows and I just, oh, that is so cute. Oh, I can't, that is so cute. Anyways, as I was saying, I don't know when I will be using this. I know, I, I'm pretty sure it's like more designed for like maybe potentially a baby shower. Nobody in real life, at least here, that's... I have to deal with with the baby shower quite soon or anytime soon so I might be using this hopefully for like graduation or something I think it was I thought it was just so cute and I felt like getting the kit because it's just so neutral and I love it so that is all I got from Glam Planner I know we were kind of rambling a little bit but I just really liked these three kits and then hopefully all the other kits I want I actually made a list for so I will be hopefully getting all those kits i think there's like five or six on my list not including the christmas ones that she just released like a few she might have released yesterday by the time you guys are watching this so october 2nd she released her christmas art and i'm just so in love i love her christmas art i love her holiday art i'm just gonna hop into the next shop so next shop i actually have is every minute a story i actually have two orders i don't know why for some odd reason, I think I was, I don't know. This one was from all the way back in like, I don't, to be honest, I don't remember when I ordered this and there's no invoice that came with it so I can't really tell you what I ordered. So, and this is the journaling card I received in the first order. I'm just gonna put it like this, that's kind of weird. And it's like this little, um, I think it's a monk. I'm sorry if I offended anybody, I'm so sorry. And it's like meditating just so cute. I don't know if I'll keep that to be honest with you. And then um, there are a few freebies I got. So you first get like this freebie, which I think is like the every order freebie. Oh my gosh, literally same. I need a whole sheet of that. And then this is the Facebook freebie at the time. I think it was like about tomatoes or something, but it's like a farmer's market kind of thing. And I think if you spent like, normally if you spent like, I think it's $20, you get like a die cut. So this week I ordered, it was like this Hermione one. Is it Hermione, right? And she's like in a Gryffindor kind of costume. And it, oh, <laughs> I just dropped it. It says, believe in yourself. I don't know. I am not a Harry Potter person, so I don't know who I'll be giving that to. They did send me two oop sheets, so we got like this little raining one, which where I live, it never rains unless if it's monsoon season, which we didn't have a big one this year. And then we had the, and then we, oh my gosh. And then I got this like book themed one, which is kind of cat themed. Which normally Alicia cuts these out for me, which is so generous of her. Love her so much for doing that, but like she's gonna take that one. And if she doesn't, honestly, I'll just give it to her because she loves cats. But this is totally me. And I'm so glad they actually gave me this because I am a student, as you all know. And I always need student stickers. I'll show you guys what I got first. So 
like for myself so first i got this really cute b die cut i don't know why i just thought it was so adorable and oh my gosh sorry about my thumb that is so disgusting uh, i'm just gonna hide it like this this is really pretty b onesie die cut and then i did get this cookie monster one and it looks so darn cute eating the cookie i don't know what i'm gonna do and all my friends know i love cookies and then um i did get a baby yoda one which i'm not into star wars i'm pretty sure i'd mentioned it in a haul but I thought this was so cute that baby yoda is everything it just looks so happy and i'm like oh my gosh i need that in my life i ordered two sheets for myself so of course speaking about cookies i got this sheet for myself this is the oh nom 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 <laughs> it has like the cookie monster here it's got like just like a whole bunch of things eating cookies oh my gosh i can't wait to use these i'm just i'm so excited and i wish some of them didn't have bows in my opinion just because I could use them for like when I hang out with Cassidy and Dom because obviously Dom does not wear bows and Cassidy doesn't either but like it you know it could represent her anyways and I don't know I just wish some of them didn't have bows that way they were pretty neutral but that's okay and then we got these like really cute motivational cookie ones and they are literally you are one tough cookie i love that i love anything like motivational and i just need like more self-love stickers and look at the little cookie with the little weight that is too cute her i don't know if she watches my haul videos but if she does that's okay too so i did order her this really cute slot sheet as you all know emily loves slots and look at the one with the coffee oh my gosh and i don't think she has this i was watching her sticker collection video like at least I think like two or three times just to like make sure she's never shopped from this shop <laughs> i know that sounds like really weird but like i needed to do it to reassure myself but these are so darn cute i would love these so much but like they just scream emily to me and then of course i think you guys saw coffee and a slot i'm gonna give it to her brennan's mom and i will probably talk to brennan first because his mom does love slots as well but i don't know if she'll use it so it's really cute anyways to just hoard it's probably if i do give it to his mom that'll probably be what she'll do but i don't know if she'll want it so i will ask him um probably after this whole video if he would want a sticker so that's my first order from them and then my second order which i am excited about here it is um i just got it like maybe a week or two ago most of these are for friends too See, I normally don't place orders from them, and when I do, it's like they have like a big release or like some sort of release. I don't really know, or like a new Facebook freebie or a really cute freebie. Anyway, so I got this really cute all orders freebie. Oh my gosh, that is so darn cute. I'm gonna have to get a whole sheet of those. It says fill in positive, fill in pop. I can't talk. Fill in positive today. We got this Facebook freebie, which is like Candyland themed. That is just too darn cute. And then look at this journaling card oh my gosh this is this is cute like i'm not even gonna lie with you guys i love that so it says live life in full bloom and then i think i spent like 20 dollars or something so i got this die cut and this one is so adorable too i just loved her little character first sheet i got was this one i asked alicia if she wanted like a certain sheets and stuff but yeah i'm just gonna quickly show you guys these these are like little cats and these like budgeting ones these for viv from viv loves plan i'm hoping that she doesn't have these because she is a hufflepuff and she's my planner mom and i blanked out on ordering something for her for her birthday so i will be sending these to her for christmas because i am just i feel so bad for not sending her anything for her birthday at all so these are really cute hufflepuff stickers i cannot wait to see what she does with these i don't know if she watches my hauls but i ordered these ones for my friend shay sb plans on instagram if you guys are interested i asked her if she wanted a sheet and these are just so cute i have to order a sheet for myself because these are literally me look at how cute they're like rainbow themed and then these sheets i think are all for me i'm pretty sure but they did throw in this really cute winter self-care bucket list one and this one isn't even like oops or anything which is oh maybe it is what I normally do is just cut out like the scripts, which I know probably defeats the purpose of like um, bucket list, but you can use these for other things. Like if you need that one sticker, you have it here pretty much. 
And then I ordered these sheets, which I thought I didn't get these sheets, guys. These sheets? What? <laughs> I thought I didn't get this sheet of stickers. So these are the pumpkin spice ones. I can't wait to add these to, like, my fall... I was supposed to say selection, collection, section in my binder, my sticker binder. And I don't have any fall-related stickers. Well, I do, but there's not that many because I am not a huge Halloween person or like fall person in general. So, and they have like little lattes in their hands, I think, or pumpkin spice. I don't know what you want to call them. Anyways, they're so adorable. I just love the little, I think they're called beans. I could be wrong. I'm sorry. And then I did get these ninjas. I don't know. I just thought they were so cute and I felt like I needed them, but they are ninja shoppers. Look at how darn cute they are with like the credit card and the money and just like throwing it everywhere. That's totally me. And then lastly, I got these really cute headphone ones. I, like I said, I think in like, I think a few hauls ago, I love any stickers with headphones on them because I am like such a music person. As you all know, I listen to so much music and these stickers are so helpful. I might just have to order another sheet. They're not even just for like podcasts or gaming. You can use them for literally listening to music, which I feel like <laughs> I need somebody to bond with over that so anyways that i'm sorry you know i'm kind of like organizing while i'm talking that's all i got from every minute a story highly recommend shopping from them but the only thing is is that they are canadian based i want to say yeah they are canadian based so it does take some time just to get the package and the next shop i actually got stickers from was from jojo kwan plans or joe's page she's so sweet and I thought I lost this package, or the package got lost in the mail, but it didn't. And I was so relieved, because I was messaging her, and I was like, oh, I think I lost it. Or, no, I think the mail lost it, or something like that. So she actually did give me a note as well, and I just thought it was so cute. I'm going to throw up, like, my last name and stuff. But look at her hand lettering. Oh my gosh, I'm, like, so in love. Sorry about, like, my hands and stuff. But, like, I love my, I love the way she wrote my name. Oh, my gosh. I never say that. It took, like, literally, like, a month to a month and a half. But she is based in Singapore, I think. She's somewhere in Asia, and I know that. So, you do get, like, a few freebies. So, I got, I don't know if this is, like, an old order freebie or whatnot. But it is collab with Habershire. How cute. It has, like, these different quotes and stuff. So, we have family meal, cafe takeaway, relaxing shower. So tired. Literally me. There are, like, PR girls. So I think at the time I asked for Kate's Plans 24. I felt like this one was the one I would relate to to the most. These are the first ones. I feel like in one of my hauls I was mentioning that I need vacuuming stickers because that is like the only thing I pretty much do in laundry around my house. It really look like me, kind of, and it's like one of those old fashioned vacuums and I am just so in love. Look how darn cute and it's a collab sheet. And then I did get, I didn't get any customs, which I will be ordering customs from her on Black Friday. I'm so excited. I love her hand lettering. Such a big fan. And first I got laundry ones, as I was saying. Only thing I really do around the house. Then I got a post Instagram one. These are super tiny, which I really like. I like tinier stickers just to like put even in like half boxes or little things. It's so much more easier. But anyways, I don't really mark when I post on Instagram. I don't know. I just don't think it's important to me to mark it. But if I need to cover up some white space or something, like I will mark it. And then I did get sleep in. Oh, I just love it so much. I always need sleep in, sleep in stickers. Wow. And then organized sticker stash, which I already used one. I'm sorry. I got too excited. And her paper, her clear paper is just like really nice. Love the hand lettering on top and then like normal hand handwriting on the bottom. And this is study sesh, which I'm going to have to get a whole bunch of like school related ones from her. I know she has a school related line and I just want to order a whole bunch. And then like I want to get customs from her and she knows that. So girl, if you're watching this Josephine, literally I am such a big fan of your stickers and your hand lettering. Oh my gosh, I just can't. I'm so jealous. So anyways, that is all I got from her. The next shop, I next shop kind of, wanted to get into was my friend Shay. I know I've mentioned her in this haul already but she did make me some customs and it was really sweet of her to do if you guys are interested in following her instagram go ahead she actually just recently made it i'm so happy she's getting recognized and she also just recently made a youtube so first of course i had to get one that says with brennan if you guys don't know brennan is my boyfriend i just can't and i need to show him these <laughs> and then i also got a facetime brennan one i need like more customs of facetiming him now they are a little big on the bigger side which is something that i think that if 
possible to make them tinier that'd be kind of good because i personally like using these in like half boxes and things like that um not half boxes quarter or like fancy labels i think that's what they're called from the like kits and stuff but i will still use them of course i did get a facetime alicia one which was so sweet of her to do for me of course i did get a dutch bros one which this is like a really good generous amount um of dutch bros ones and there's different variations love the way she wrote that and then lastly i am so excited about this sheet because this is the first sheet that has my two in real life best friends names and i do need to order like a ton of different customs of their names because i don't have any stickers of their names and there was like a period of time where like we all weren't talking it was just, it was really weird but now we're like we're pretty gucci as i like to call it so anyways if you guys don't know if you don't follow me on my personal instagram these are my two best friends um cassie and dom and one day i'll do a plan with me about them but what's funny is that the y is kind of messed up <laughs> and that is completely fine i'm not even mad about it like some of these some of these are like pretty good i'm okay with it it could have just been the printer and I am okay with that, completely fine, um, but these are just, like, cute anyways, and I showed them, and they thought they were, like, so cool, because they had their name on it, so thank you so much again, Shay, I'm so glad you're making custom, so this girl on, I think, like, one of the Facebook chats, or group chats, I don't know, sent me, like, a whole bunch of stickers, so I just wanted to, like, quickly show you guys, I love these little laundry ones, and then these little packages with the little kawaii faces. There's just like a whole bunch. I kept these ring ones just in case. I don't know one day I'll use them. I don't know. And then these really cute minimal boxes that remind me of like the tickets that you get from like one of those arcades. That's what it reminded me of. I thought these were like those tickets, but they aren't. Anyways, there's like a whole bunch of stickers in here. I just kept a few and I just wanted to kind of show you guys that because it was so sweet. Now, the person that did send me these does not have like a social media platform so unfortunately i can't link that for you guys hey guys sorry like anything changed i was trying to find an order to show you guys and it took me forever I finally found it within like 15 minutes of just rummaging my room I'm just gonna go ahead and continue on with the next shop which is hey poly studio if you guys don't know i am a pr girl which sounds so weird to say out loud the owner paulina she wrapped everything really nicely in this like cheetah print gift wrapping tissue paper and she is based i think in ukraine don't quote me on that but she is based not in the states not in canada and she just recently started to ship international props to her doing that totally respect shops that do that as well then she wrote this really cute i'm gonna just say postcard but it's not a postcard it's a little i guess like journaling card with my name on it like i say all the time love anything personalized with my name on it there's all her information which of course i will link and you can use my code stage 15 for 15 percent off and i have my pr preview which i am so excited to show you guys and if you guys are coming from my instagram you guys would have had seen it already. also packaging 10 out of 10 look at how gorgeous that is i just can't it's in this really pretty purple holographic packaging and i haven't really seen anybody haul her shop she did gift me this really cute journaling card i don't know anybody that has red hair so if you have red hair let me know let a girl know because i don't plan on using that and then she did send me like a few typical like freebies so she sent me this really cute sampler one and i can't tell if the girl has black or brown hair but i have black hair you can't really tell on camera probably but i want to say that it does have brown hair i don't know but i have black hair anyways i think this one is so cute the one meditating that is so darn cute really cute halloween sampler food one which i don't like i said don't have a lot of halloween things i am not the biggest person in the halloween i know the planner community is but i am just not and this is going to be a really good addition to add alicia likes these candy apples so she's probably like oh my gosh i'm jealous we do have these princess coffee cups which i've never seen any shop do i think this is such a good creation and there's just like different princesses so we have awara cinderella ariel bell i think this is pocahontas or moana maybe you know i can't really tell on that one it's kind of hard to decipher and then we have tiana elsa and rapunzel hey, she was so nice and she even sent me die cuts so she sent me this really cute one with this girl and she's with the candle and the little pumpkin is a candy corn. I just can't. And then she is wearing a witch hat and it looks emo like me. Love it. And then <laughs> I got this one with like um, really cute washi tape rolls. We have like little pumpkins, ghosts, and candy corn. 
and I think I was saying this on Instagram and I got um like a few DMs about it, but like literally I don't mean to offend any artist, but these hats, like witch hats, remind me of like the triangular racers that like teachers give you in school or they remind me of a traffic cone. I don't know why. Every single person that draws a witch hat, it just reminds me of that. And I know people can't unsee it after what I said. So I ordered a few sheets. So first I guess I'll start off with is the laundry sheets. She looks so funny upside down. I might just have to put them in my planner like this because they're they're low key so funny. I did get these princess bulba ones. Oh my gosh, there's so many variations of Princess Bulbas. Oh, so this one has to be Moana then. Because I think this one is Pocahontas, right? Anyways, I was just thinking about it. So this is what they look like. And if you're wondering what material her stickers are on, I want to say it's like a glossy vinyl. I'm not 100% sure. I would totally go ahead and DM her, like ask her about that. But it's definitely not like a matte super nice in my opinion there is lilo which i know there is a controversy about lilo also being a princess speaking about bulbas paulina was so nice and customized this whole entire sheet of girls with yellow sweaters with the pink bulbas if you all don't know from my bonivas creations order in my last few hauls i love pink bulbas they are just so darn cute and she's hugging it she is hugging it literally this is me when i get home and i drink it and it's probably like halfway gone and she looks so like fancy with the glasses. I just, it's so funny. I just can't. One day I just want to like dress up like this and like actually get it so you guys can see that. This is literally me. Lastly, I got these FaceTiming ones. As you all know, Alicia, my planner best friend, I decided to go ahead and get her in this variation and then this is me. But I think this was the most variation that like looked like her the most. So we have like a red, green, and pink because I know red and green are like our two favorite colors and then these are like my favorite colors. And then I did get like a ton of various phone ones, so um, you're probably wondering why there's this random blonde girl. I've already explained it on my Instagram, but this is from my really good friend Sarah. Her and I, we FaceTime like, we usually like, FaceTime like at least two times a month, but she's been so busy with like um, school and things like that. So I've just kind of been like, oh my gosh, like I literally miss you. But we text like, if not every day, every other day, just to, like catch up and stuff. But yeah, I literally love her so much. And that was my order. And now I am going to be showing you guys my PR freebie. Alina and I have been in the works to be making a freebie for myself. And I am like so excited that like shops actually want to collaborate. I don't think she's done this before. And I am just really grateful she gave me the opportunity to work with her on this. So this is what my PR freebie looks like, guys. This is so cute. Literally has a girl swimming. We got a YouTube play button. We got the girl drinking boba, studying, like a FaceTime one, and of course the sunflower because I literally told her, girl, can you add this for me? And she was like, yes. So anyways, we have like different variations of girls. So I probably will be sending these out in like care pack, care pack, which is what like happy meal, I guess. So yeah, looking forward to doing that and then keeping some for myself. But if you guys are truly interested on in getting the freebie from her, that is my freebie, if that makes sense. Yeah. Um, if you guys are interested on in getting my freebie in your order, all you have to do is just put in the notes to description that you want my freebie and then name your complexion and hair color, whatever you want, because she has different various options. So yeah, I just wanted to go ahead and just highlight this. This is so flipping cute. I just can't. And also she just did this like last minute too. And I was like, oh my gosh, that's everything. I love it. It's so tiny. Look how cute and tiny it is. So yeah, that is all I got from Pink Polly Studio. Right now as I'm filming, she is doing a giveaway. It's probably gonna end by the time you guys are watching this. She has hit 100 followers on her, I'm gonna call it like her international Instagram, but she does have like a pretty big following on her other Instagram. So I will leave both of those in the description box below for you guys to check her out. Okay, so next order we have is from Murdoch Talks. I don't know why I had never really ordered from her <laughs> because I was gonna actually order from her when she had the pink and orange tie-dye foil release and I was like oh my gosh it's so cute but then I missed out on it and then there was another orange foil she came out with missed out on that and then there was another two foils like a double foil release missed out on that because I was in the hospital so that is the tea on that um first thing you get is like this really cute freebie I know that Laura Lee is that her Laura Lee right I want to say that's who is like a PR quote unquote PR girl for Ashley I think is that her name she is Canadian based so never really ordered from her this is my first order 
and it has this really cute like curvy and the foiling is wonderful they get a few oop sheets which i think are like super super good quality in my opinion like these oop sheets i can still use and i'll be fine like obviously if you look up close like they're definitely oops but like to me it's fine um these were the only sheets that were like in stock that i personally could use and i was like dang it i wish i could have gotten like all foils but i was just waiting till last minute to where i can place like an order for a foil that i liked with these so first i obviously did have to get a chipotle sheet you can definitely tell they're oops if you like look like super duper close but i mean i can't really tell so it's fine i got chipotle and hollow chipotle and rose gold oh my gosh it is so gorgeous it does look a little gold and then i got chick-fil-a and hollow it is so darn pretty and then we got chick-fil-a in silver which you can definitely tell like i said there are oops, but like, it's fine. I feel like these are still usable. And then lastly, I did get Burger King in the hollow and then Burger King in the rose gold. So yeah, those were all the oops sheets I could pick up. These were the only ones in stock and she doesn't really have too many more in stock by the time you guys are probably watching this. So this was the foil I ordered this week. And I'm so excited. This is such a stunning, like a stunning foil. Did remind me of like the pink and orange tie-dye, but this is the like blue and yellow tie-dye. I know so many people were like fangirling over it. So quick story about this. She gave me, I think two of these on accident because I ordered two of these, the header overlays because I like using these as half cut headers in my planner. But she did give me two of the full box overlay. That foil though, it is so pretty. But the foil is flying like everywhere as you can like kind of tell. I don't know if that's really common or not. Then we have the bottom washi, super cute. The scripts, super cute. And then we have so many icons, which I don't really use icons, but it is what it is. And then we got the dates, the corners, and the weekend banner. I don't know why weekend looks so weird spelled like that. I don't know. Maybe I'm just tripping. And then we have a half cut header here, but I pretty much use these headers as them. It's fine. Anyway, so that is all I got from Murdoch Talks or Ashley. I'm pretty sure that's how you pronounce her name. Um, I actually just placed another order. I think it was, was it last week on her foil or like this week maybe. I honestly don't know. I, I basically placed another order. I just like, I'm such a big fan of her, like basically her double colored ones. So like anything with combination like pink and orange or like this blue and yellow or like pink and green like anything like just with double colors i don't know why i'm just like such a huge fan so can't wait to order from her again last shop i wanted to show you guys was spc for some reason i'm kind of salty no offense i didn't get a rack bag with this i mean i'm glad that i got freebies something about it is like i just love rack bags but like i didn't get a rack bag in this order and i don't know if that was intentional or not and i understand like there's no guarantee probably on getting a rock bag so first you do get this really cute journaling card which i don't think i'm going to be too stashing this one this one is so darn cute so it's this bow it has like this ombre effect this green is it like hollow it's like a green hollow and i know she was giving these out last year because i i think i have like just one from last year and then this foil which i am like so excited whenever she releases this it's just this like really pretty pink hollow got the $75 freebie apparently and it's just in this coppery foil so. so I'll just get started with the scripts that I got because those will go pretty quick so first I got all the four foils in vacuum because I think I showed you guys those stickers I vacuum too much so it's like I need a script and I I have a script from Kenzie's but I don't know I just need more variation so I got all of them in the four foils and then I did get all of the four foils in my feelings ones because I thought I got these but I didn't these are literally a mood, and I am going to have to probably give a few of these to Plans with Emily. We have just, like, a few add-ons that I needed from, like, other kits that I ordered in the past. So I got the 15mm of Hello Class, and then I got the, like, Fashion Girls, which literally... I mean, she kind of looks like me, but, like, kind of doesn't, obviously. Like, I don't have tattoos or anything, but it was the closest resemblance. If anything, this little girl looks like me. Like, literally, if I were to use an element, she looks like me. More than anything in this. I did get the foil, one of the foils, I think, of the week, which is this pretty stunning, like, red. And you can use this with so much. You can use this during Christmas, Valentine's Day. That's what I was just thinking about. Um but it's this really pretty red and i don't know what i'm gonna be using this for i just picked it up because i was like oh my gosh just i just need it so it's in the bow format and i feel like it'd look good with cruella if anybody has that kit 
Um, even though I know Alicia and I were talking about it, the red is a little bit overpowering in the K in my opinion. Just can't look at all that red though. And then it comes with like all the pool box overlays. Guys, I'm just, oh my gosh, it's so gorgeous. And then we have like all of the other icons and then we have like this strip. Which in my opinion, I really hope she does do this often where she sells just the scripts individually. I would love a sheet of just like more scripts and different foils because that would be, that would be super great. And then we have the bottom lash sheet, which I don't know how to feel about it. I don't know. I don't have a lot of foils in this bow format. Is that what it's called? Like of this bow format? A few kits. I only got two, which sounds like not a lot. So I'll just get started with this one actually. So I ordered... This kit, I was contemplating whether or not to order this because I know it's reformatted and everything. I love the Polaroid and I just love the vibrant colors. I just don't know what I'm using it. Like I know there were Christmas add-on boxes, but I'm like, I don't think I'm gonna be using it for Christmas. Also pizza, it has donuts. Oh my gosh, donuts sound so good right now. There's so many sweets. Anyways, I think she made this for somebody's birthday maybe? I mean, obviously, obviously. And then it comes with like this freebie, which I love. Literally, if I get more freebies of this, that would be great. I love freebies like that. So I did get the mini kit. And then I got the add-ons. I didn't get the 15 millimeter. I don't know. I don't plan on using that probably. But I did get the glitter headers and the label sampler. Just because I got a mini kit. And I need to buy a label sampler with this. So anyways, this is what it looks like. Forky is literally my life. And that is also me. Like literally all my emotions right there in all those bags. Um yeah so this is what it looks like it's so vibrant that's why i'm in love and i love all these like little things and then all these boxes that is my life oh my gosh look at the wa yeah washi wow i almost blanked out look at the washi this is so adorable a lot of people were excited that this kit did get reformatted the last kit i got was christmas party i almost blanked out on this i don't know why but i did get some add-ons so i did get the glitter headers label sampler 15 millimeter i'm starting to order more of these just because like i probably will be using this like next year i don't plan on using it this year and then fashion fashion what the fan boxes i keep calling them fashion boxes but you do get a pretty good generous amount the only reason why i got this one is because this one looks like brennan the most there's nothing that kind of looks like me in this but that's like totally okay i love the nails though if anything my sister like does her nails like that all the time then this is supposed to be a birthday kit and I don't know if I will be using this as a birthday kit. I didn't even know that it came with like this as a freebie until I actually got the kit. So it's Mary Beating. I do like how the colors are like correlating. I did get a mini format of this kit as well. So this is what it looks like. Look at that double box scene. That is everything. Those wine bottles though. <laughs> the cookies are like my life. And then the balloon. I really liked this kit in my opinion. It definitely stood out to me as a Christmas kit. Oh my gosh, look at all the little things. But yeah, it definitely stood out to me. This is the bottom washi, not too busy, which I love, as you all know. But it really just stood out to me, and I felt like I needed it, so I got it. That is all I got from SPC. I can't wait to organize all this because these have been in a pile for the longest time. And that is it for my haul, guys. I know I was definitely very talkative, but I feel like I haven't talked to you guys in like so long. But as always, if you guys have any other recommendations for shops, leave that in the comments down below. And I will talk to you guys in the next one. Bye!